Faith, by Pastor Cornelius R. Stam. Faith is one of the most precious treasures a man can possibly possess. It is a pity that so few understand what the Bible teaches about it. Faith is often confused with presumption, optimism, determination, superstition and imagination. Actually it is simply believing. This is why we read in Rom. 4. 5. But to him that worketh not, but believeth on him that justifieth the ungodly, his faith is counted for righteousness. Obviously, faith honors God, while doubting his word must insult and displease him. The Apostle John wrote, If we receive the witness of men, the witness of God is greater. He that believeth not God hath made him a liar, because he believeth not the record that God gave of his Son. And this is the record, that God hath given to us eternal life, and this life is in his Son, I John 5, 9-11. Little wonder that we read in Heb. 11. 6. Without faith it is impossible to please him, for he that cometh to God must believe that he is, and that he is a rewarder of them that diligently seek him. But why did God give the law, if salvation can be obtained by simple faith? Street. Paul answers. The law was our schoolmaster, to bring us unto Christ, that we might be justified by faith, Gal. 324. Do we then make void the law through faith? God forbid. Yea, we establish the law. Wrong. 331. How grateful we all should be that God, in the Bible, has told us about redemption through Christ and how we may be saved by faith in Him. Christ was delivered for our offenses, and was raised again for our justification. Therefore, being justified by faith we have peace with God through our Lord Jesus Christ. Wrong. 425. 5. 1. 